what was the need of uh, this discussion on uh, women's participation in uh, politics? Uh, yeah, actually, uh, you see, these days, I, uh, though, uh, of course, most of the women nowadays they have come forward. Uh, but still, we are uh, there are very few representative. You no, know, if you look at our uh, legislative assembly or even in the district council. So, apart from that, what we are more concerned is uh, uh, women participation in the local government. Especially, uh, uh, we are concerned about the lo uh, local government, and we want that at least women also should have the opportunity to participate. In because uh, in uh, as uh, any problem that faced by the women we feel that it, it is necessary for the you know for the women folk to be part of the decision making process so that they can uh, deal with the situation uh, accordingly uh, because according to of course according to our customary law uh, customary custom uh, that only men folk are Women folk are not allowed to participate in the uh, local dharma. So what we feel is that uh, the time has come when that women also should be part of this uh, in the local dharma. Has this ever been raised in the past to you know change or to amend to bring these changes to allow women folk to be part of the local dharma? Uh, so far, of course, well, from the Lumpungi Sangate, we have sent some. Uh, Memorandum to the we have discussed also earlier in the right from 19 uh, 2011 we had had discussion then we met uh, recently also we met the uh, CEM of the district council uh, but uh, so far nothing has come in because uh, according to our uh, small survey we have done is that uh, mostly uh, mostly the doorbar the uh, was telling that if we get a direction from the district council or so we we, we we don't have any problem for the women to be part of the the okay. and this uh Singanthai it's basically to pick up issues about the women's participation in the issues in society or what exactly we can t just tell us in brief about Lumpungki Singanthai? No Singanthai actually we, we are we are more or less we are trying to raise the status of the you know women then to see about the to about their education about their health care and we have done small small program in different parts of the in different part of the state we have gone to highlight the importance of you know, for women to come forward to take part uh, in the decision making process to know about their rights you know these are the thinking that uh, from the Lumpungi Singh we are taking so at the moment, if one has to understand in Meghalaya, is it because we are seeing there are legislators, like mm. Ampere, yes, like you've already mentioned in the district mm. council, also there are female mm. legislators. Yes. So, which doesn't mean that women are not allowed to participate. Mm. They are allowed. In the state legislature, district council, they are allowed, but only local debate. In some localities, women are not allowed to be executive members or even to attend the the, the debate balloon. Mm. Well, what may be the reason that this is still there, like you know, barring women to be part of the local darbar? Yeah, traditionally maybe women were not allowed, but now with the change in the, you know in the state and the country as a whole, we need women. As for instance, Panchati Raj, where more than fifty percent women are participating. But here we want that women should be part of the decision-making process right from the grassroots, so that they can see things with their own eyes, they can discuss the issues related to them only from the woman's side only. So that means is the Lumpung going to take this issue further to pressurize those at the heads to change this uh, practice and ensure that women are part of it? Yes, continuously we are doing that. Whenever we go to the villages also, we educate them, you know, and we did have a meeting also with Rang Bashnong discuss about no one is against that but there's some rule or some improbably maybe because of that only. But that wise, traditionally we are not allowed. But now with the changes the situation, women have to be there. Supposing a woman MGC takes charge of the Ilaka, all the headmen and all these aims, the thing, they have to go to the, the, the in charge of Ilaka, MGC who is a woman. Supposing, I said. Mm. So do you think it's because you know that 
change is still not coming. Why? Because maybe there's an inferiority or... No, not that, not inferiority, but I think women by nature, I think they don't want to go into the stress and strain of public life. They're very careful about the family. Once they go into politics, they have to is 24 7 duties. So, in that and that also. And maybe they feel, still have that feeling that uh, politics is a male domain. So, maybe they have that feeling also. And moreover, politics is so, what to say, dirty now. We see in the newspaper every time. I think women do not want to be involved in all those things. So, so how does the Lumpur plan to go ahead to educate these women to come forward and take up this task? Yeah, we have 28 uh, members who of the women organization of different localities because Lumpur Sankate is an apex body comprising of all these. So they can take up at the local region, at the Seng in the different localities like for opening Lankra, Jiao, maybe they can take up that level and we will help them in case they need us from the Lumpur Sankate side. So how do you see today's gathering? Was it a very positive Yes, morning? very positive, very positive and they have given good ideas. So we want the cooperation because now we need to have a strong woman force. As you see socially, politically, everything, we have to have a woman for a strong woman, a voice, a strong voice of woman. That's what I said, we, can, we have to see things by our own eyes, by our own ideas. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to East Mojo. For any queries, put them down in the comments section below and press on the bell icon for notifications.